Hello, guys and gals, me, Mudahar, and welcome to a game simply known as The Strange Game by Ninja Boy. I know you may not be able to see it very well with the menu, but it is a Ninja Boy creation. Um, <laughs> this game is just a strange game. It's made an RPG Maker, so it's kind of nostalgic in the sense that uh, I played quite a fair bit of RPG Maker games in my time, but uh, <laughs> if we can get out of the uh, French menu screen, and then we can get the uh, standard... <laughs> English out of nowhere, so we got multilingual, uh, multi, multiling, multilingual support, if I can fucking use my words correctly. But, that being said, I'm gonna keep this intro nice and short, and we got a spooky little demon with blue eyes in the background, and about fucking nine teeth. Let's hit new game and see what this shit's all about. Welcome to the strange game. The game will have more effect at night or with the lights off. Well, it is, uh, fucking night right now. I know you may not be able to see it, bro, but it's night. Um, I'm not gonna have the lights off, otherwise I'll blend into the fucking background. <laughs> and, uh, let's go. <laughs> as long as the FPS is changing, you're moving forward. It'll shift to run. <clears throat> <laughs> That's like the first time I've ever read it like that. As long as your FPS is moving, you're doing good. The game hasn't died yet. Uh, press X to bring up the menu. This will let you save and quit, but if you press X one more time, the game will end. Also, Game Sports Gamepad to use. Just plug one in and play. This is just in case you don't want to use your keyboard. Enjoy. All right. Well, apparently. Okay, so let's just look this over real carefully. Character identity card. Character name. Game made by. Character profile. Ninja Boy. Character properties. Tell me if you find any problem in the game. 169, 195, 108, 108. That's all of our stats. Location is Strange 001. Apparently, it's something to do with states. I don't know. And you got like four variables. I think. Wait, hope you mana points experience. I think it, I, I don't know what the fuck emoji that is, dude. Hope you had fun. Oh wait, okay, this is this is confusing as shit, man. I'm already fucking, I'm already out of my mind. All right. Well, I'm glad we ran into our first error. Give me a second, ladies and gentlemen. We'll be right back. All right, man. We're back with our. Uh, we're we're back with take two of the strange game. Let's go forward. Apparently, shift is to speed through it faster. So, oh my god, dude, that sound effect, I totally forgot. That was like the Al Oni sound effects, dude. So, essentially, if we look around, this is basically a fucking grid-based game. It's actually not even like a first-person shooter. And to be honest, it's kind of impressive they made this on RPG Maker, because as far as I know, RPG Maker is like incredibly 2D-oriented. Like, but the fact that you can do shit like this shows me that they could have, like, some really sick dungeon crawler games to it, too. Because I'm getting, like, uh, Etrian Odyssey vibes, and it seems like everything's changed. I got this nice little, uh, checkerboard ground with these fucking awful walls here, by the way. It's like, who the fuck? Bro. I don't know if y'all heard that shit, but that was fucking weird. Uh, the game... Uses audio. Holy fuck, I scared myself. I, like, scratched it onto the side. What the fuck? That was weird, dude. <laughs> Alright, so it seems like it's literally just a giant hallway simulator. Okay. It seems as if the, uh... Well, I mean, I do have an FOV of 40, so that's, like, adding to the entire, you know, fun right here. This is this is where this shit's all at, man. Uh, I guess I can look sort of behind me. Well, there doesn't seem to be shit. Alright. Let's just go forward. Seems like this is all there is to the world. I'm looking at the previews to see if it comes in bright by the- Ooh, we got the follow the fucking dots, uh, shit over here. But remember, as long as the FPS is moving, it means the game is actually functioning. That's about it, really. I mean, it just seems to be a giant hallway simulator, man. That's really fucking it. It's just like a black screen with white dots. <laughs> Don't really know what to say. Is the game moving? Oh, oh, it is moving, okay. It's literally just like walk straight, that's it. Like occasionally there will be like a little wall you can see on the side, but that's about fucking it, dude. <laughs> what the fuck am I playing? <laughs> I mean, I I'll, I'll give it something. The game certainly is incredibly strange. <laughs> like, okay, at least now we got some fucking texture. All right, so we got this nice little chest set ground here. I don't know why, but it actually kind of feels like I'm walking through like abandoned linear ass gyms of a Pokemon game. I was somehow cancelled and shit. But one thing is, man, I'm really surprised it's made in, like, RPG Maker. But as far as I can really say, this just seems to be a, a spooky walk- Oh! Different fucking- Holy shit, dude, the walls look stretched out. 
I don't even know why, but I just keep thinking of fucking Final Fantasy 13 right now. Just because that game was also a hallway simulator, and this is also a hallway simulator, albeit slightly spooky. Alright. Bro, what? Dude, it's loud! Holy shit! Oh my god! Like, it starts off slow, but it's like, it gets so fucking loud. I will give it something. Audio-wise, this game's like up there in terms of uh, atmosphere and shit, dude. Like, it's there, man. <laughs> I don't even know what it is. I don't know why, but I think I have, a, like, a graphic bug where, like, the game is- it looks like a re- it's like what I would like to call the reaction channel graphic setting. Oh, dude, the walls are turning green. Holy shit. The walls are green. Oh my god, dude. What the fuck is this? Drunk LSD mode right now? Oh, the walls are now gone. So it's got this reaction channel graphic setting where, like, part of it's a square and it's got, like, this, like, back- Okay, there's, like, eyes on the wall. Somehow I get a feeling that somebody's watching me. <laughs> it's weird, dude. It's kind of like everybody in the comments who writes that there's, like, a fucking stalker behind my window here. You know, the first time you ever- you all started, like, writing those comments, I actually got, like, legit- Okay, what the fuck, dude? Now I'm getting, like, I see you vibes here. That game we played a while back. Holy shit, dude, it's loud! Relax! Holy fuck, dude. Like, holy fuck, man, it's loud as shit! This guy! I'm gonna keep one of them off, man, it's really fucking loud! Oh my god! I will say, the ga like, th there's not a whole lot of gameplay happening here. It's just like an... Okay, well, that's a cute little kitten right there, man. Like, it's... The fuck, man? It's not... Like, I'll tell you right now, dude, like, honestly... It's probably the creepiest hallway simulator that I've played. Holy fuck, dude, these audio cues are, like, so loud. It's like, Jesus Christ, man. Fuck. They're loud, dude. Holy shit, man. You have no idea. It's fucking weird. It's fuck. Alright, well, at least we're getting, like, different changes of environment. I haven't looked behind me in a while. No, oh, it doesn't seem to be anything. I guess we must- we should just keep trudging forward. This is so weird. It really is weird. It's strange. It's fucking weird, dude. Okay, now we have just ground textures. That's it. I'm like, like, you know what? Like, I rip on Five Nights at Freddy's all the time, but I think I understand why people really get spooked to that. Because, you know, you're kind of waiting for a jump scare to hit, like... Like, I'm so waiting for a fucking jump scare to hit. It's like... It's like I'm getting seven days flashbacks, too. Like, I'm waiting for something to fucking happen, like... You have no idea, dude. Like, it's some pulse-pounding shit to an extent. But at the end of the day, it's just a fucking hallway simulator! There's not much else to it other than... We're walking down a hallway. Together. As a team, lads. Yeah? <laughs> what the fuck, man? <laughs> the kind of shit that I find on the internet, dude. I mean, like, to be honest, with the title, like, The Strange Game, you couldn't expect me not to download it. It was pretty much begging to be played. Alright, now I'm expecting something to just fucking pop up, dude, because the previews have gotten completely dark as shit. I'm barely able to see anything. Except here- okay, what the fuck is that? Is that, like, Minecraft creeper faces right there on the wall? Alright. We're in what I like to call the, uh, rope room. Oh my god. Okay, this is like the fucking sixth time I've heard this audio cue. It's getting a little old. That was like a clusterfuck, dude. That was literally a clusterfuck. That was, honest to god, just a giant fucking clusterfuck. That was weird.
That was like a clusterfuck of audio. Holy fuck, man. How long have I been walking down this one hallway? <laughs> like, Jesus. I think enough is enough, man. You're just waiting for shit to happen, dude. I'm so glad they had a run key present. Okay, now I'm- now I'm- okay, dude, now it looks like this fucking old-ass PS1 game I used to play called Akuji the Heartless. What the fuck? You made it, good job, now listen to this relaxing music if it was too creepy. Sorry, also, if you didn't like it, I tried. And there's an emoticon that I have no idea, it's just what I like to call the, uh, fucking upward arrow, uh, tilde key face. That's not exactly original. Okay. Listen to calm music. Listen to something creepy. Woo! I don't know, man. That's a that's a really okay. Well, let's listen to something creepy. That's not exactly creepy, as much as it is just. Uh... I don't even know what the fuck that is, dude. I have no idea. But, uh, that was the, uh, strange game. Um, there's not really much I can say on it other than it's definitely an experience, ladies and gentlemen. <laughs> um, it's, it's, I guess it only took us, like, I'm looking at the, uh, total overall time code, but it took us about, like, fucking 12, 11 minutes, I guess. Uh, interesting game. Um, it's just, it's literally just the, uh, spooky hallway simulator. That's literally what it is. Uh, it's got some cool audio cues, but the game recycles, like, six or seven of them. Interesting title, but, like, like, it's, it's not so much as a game, of course, this giant, creepy hallway simulator, except if your hallway, if your hallway was, like, fucking 28 miles long, and it changed materials every five or six, you know, fucking ventures into it. Uh, other than that, <laughs> that was a strange game. I really didn't know what to fucking say about this game. You know, I tried to, I, I guess I tried to make it as engaging as it was. But it, but the gameplay literally uh, boiled down to fucking, what is it, uh, just, just hold up and shift the entire time. That's exactly what it was. That being said, uh, if you like what you saw, please like, comment, subscribe, dislike if you dislike it. Um, of course, this is the kind of games we play over here, man. So I hope you guys kind of enjoy it. Um... Uh, again, yeah, these are the kind of games that, you know, hopefully <laughs> we will continue to play for a long time, provided, you know, I mean, as long as you all enjoy it. That being said, this <laughs> this was the, uh, the, 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 the strange game. <laughs> Swear to God, I was waiting for a jump scare the whole time, I was waiting for something. This game fucking trolled me, dude. Whatever, man, I am out.